Welcome to Family Gilly TV. We have got Tom. Hello. And we've got Ollie. Hello. And we're going to be looking at this today, Air Hogs Connect. Now it's a little bit different because Tom, you have got some drones, haven't you? Yeah, I'm going to drones. But you've not right. got a drone like this. Air Hogs Connect combines, as you can see here, a physical drone with yeah, I've, a video looks, game. It looks really cool. So you're looking, looking forward to trying this? Yes, please fix me. Unbox it. So this is going to be a really quick guide to how to get started with yeah. Air Hogs Connect. So we've got a few bits out of the box. First of all, we've got the mat. Tom, do you want to pick that up? Yay! It feels quite heavy. It's got little bits in the corners. Yes, it's got weight, so it stays absolutely flat. And then, Ollie, we've got the drone. What's unusual about the drone? It's really full. It's very full. It's lightweight, it's very controllable, and it's got lights on each corner. Yep. And that is so that the app can see where it is. Super, so we're going to get the app, we'll get that installed and we're going to start our first mission on Airhawks Connect. Let's go! So we've downloaded the app, we've connected it to the drone, lay the mat out in an open space in our living room and Tom is going to take his first training mission which teaches, as you can see, how to track the drone with the tablet camera. You need to keep it there in view so that the tablet knows where the drone is. Once you've done that, you just tap land and automatically it lands back on the ground and on the mat. The target audience is 10 and over, although my boys at 811 got on really well. The training takes you through each of the different modes very succinctly and gets you started. The pilot of the ship, the engineer with his grapple, the commander you drop down, and of course the firefighter. Once we've done that, we launched into the proper missions and started developing our base and working through each of the different campaign levels. As you can see, really engage the boys, they're working together, collaborating to figure out what they need to do next and how best to use those real physics of the drone that are picked up in the app gameplay. And it works on the battery life of the drone. So as you complete each of the missions, there we go, um, you extend your streak. And the further your streak goes, the more points and the more credits you earn. Then when the drone battery has run out, there is then some play that just takes place on the tablet screen. So you're playing without the physical drone, but still earning points and still able to continue um, with the game, ready to jump back in once that drone has recharged. So along with all that gameplay, you've got this real world physics. The movement of the drone isn't just simulated, but it is tracked by the iPad and you're getting that real drone flight experience. The boys really like this, along with the AR mat that creates this whole world in the room that you can really explore. And as you can see, Ollie really like getting in amongst it and you can take that iPad right down to street level and have a look around in each and every of the buildings, walk right around it, peer into the shops and get a sense of what is in the world. And sometimes the game requires you to do that so the boys have to move around the room to get the right angle so they can fly their drone to where they wanted to go. The kids were also keen to see how well it worked outside and we found that in the evening you could really get the most out of those lights and the mat on the floor and play your Air Hogs Connect out in the garden. Now of course Air Hogs Connect is designed for indoor use but I was impressed with how well it worked outside. Here the real time physics take on a sort of another dimension as any little gust of wind that's passing through the space obviously has to be compensated for as you pilot your drone through the different missions. So as you can see that worked pretty well for us. So taking it back to our headquarters, you can build different facilities. There's a research centre, danger dome, squad quarters and body shop. Each has a specific function. Research centre is where you build each of these buildings. The danger zone is for playing virtually while the drone is charging and you earn power-ups. Squad quarters is where you can buy upgrades like thrusters and body types and new onboard staff and you can increase the speed and the performance of each of the weapons whether that's the commando, the water cannon or the grapple. And the body shop is where we get visual enhancements and by combining all these together you can craft your perfect drone. And this is how it gets nicely competitive with an online rank leaderboard and also you can find other friends who are playing and play just against them. The weekly challenges and rank challenges all contribute to that score so you can work your way up and see who is the best pilot amongst each of your friends. So that's our first day with Air Hogs Connect. What do you think, boys? I think it's great. I really, yeah. I really like it. But what was, what was good about it? What was different to this to say a normal drone? I like how it's got lights on it. So it yeah, knows, and when you so turn, the game knows where it is and how it's um in real in real life, if I was watching you play, they think that well, that's easier than just flying a drone up and down this mat. But it, it's actually much more and complicated wind. on here. So you've got grapples and so you're playing the game, yeah. in, and, and the stuff. game uses the physics yeah. of the drone. And when you turn yeah. it on, so Ollie, did you like the video game bit of it? Yeah. 
it's hard but I think we've got the hang of it. So you've got better yeah. as you go and we, as you play you get to do a streak with yeah. the battery life. Who had the most, who had the longest streak, the most points? Me, me. Oh I thought it was, who was it? Me, me. <laughs> so me. we have to work out who actually got the longest streak and you can each have your own profile on the game. Yeah. So do you think you'll be playing that for a long time? Yeah. yeah. And Definitely. which bits are going to keep you coming back to play more? I think upgrading, making a new base, and getting through the missions, getting yeah. a better um, it's called streak. And what of the different abilities, what was your favourite thing that the drone can do in the game? Uh, the grapple. The grapple was cool. I, 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 I don't think people dance. I was quite yeah. like the kind of thing of dropping people down. Me too. And then uh, grappling the baddie once it's killed and then grappling back up. I also like the... If there's um, a fire. <laughs> I like the fire where you can, yeah. you go yeah. and suck some water up. So if your friends were saying, should we get Air Hogs Connect, what would you say? Yes. Yeah, I really get it. Yeah. Definitely great. get it. It's really great. Cool, okay. Well, we'll check back to see how you're getting on maybe in a week or two. But for now, let's say goodbye. Bye. Bye. See you later.